Okay, today we're going to take a look at three different steps that you can do really easy on your Chromebook to help things work better. First step we're going to look at is called clearing the cache. The cache is a special folder on your Chromebook that holds parts and pieces of web apps. So anytime those web-based apps aren't interacting properly with the items in that folder, it can cause things to act a little weird. The best way to handle that is just to empty out that folder and let those items re-download as necessary. To do that, all we have to do is click over here on our browser, get that started. Then we're going to go up to these three little dots here, and we're going to choose More Tools. Then we're going to go across to Clear Browsing Data. Now it's going to open up a little panel with three check marks. We want all three of these checked, and we click Clear Data. Now if you haven't cleared your cache in a while, it's going to take a little bit, but in the end, it's going to clear all that out, and that's a good thing. You never have to worry about anything important being in the cache. These are things that help web apps run better faster, but when they're causing a problem, or if you suspect they're causing a problem, it's okay to clear them because the web app's just going to download them again the next time you launch it. Okay, the next step we're going to do is reset the browser, and that's in case you've been in the browser trying to change some settings and maybe you got things in a state where they're not exactly like you'd want them to be. To reset them back to the way they were originally we just scroll down to the bottom, we click on advanced, we scroll to the bottom again and we click restore settings to their original defaults. Click that, then we click the reset settings button and it's changing everything back the way it was before you made your changes. Okay. And the final step we're going to do is just shut down the Chromebook. When we shut down the Chromebook, it clears the RAM. The software that makes the Chromebook run is in a place called the RAM. It's, a, it's hardware. And that zeroes out when we turn off the Chromebook. If you haven't turned off your Chromebook for days and days, you just kind of shut the lid and let it go to sleep, and it's not been turned off for a while, the contents in RAM can get a little messed up. Well, when we turn off the Chromebook completely, that's emptied out, and when we turn back on the Chromebook, fresh new copies of all those files are loaded. So that too can solve a lot of problems. So clear the cache, reset the browser, restart your Chromebook, and have a great day.